On September 20th, the Yang Wang U8 Aerith SUV was launched in China. It is AWD with four electric motors and a combined output of 880 kilowatts, 1,197 horsepower. U8 can perform 360 degrees tank turn, wade, and float on water in emergencies. On September 20th, the Yang Wang U8 Aerith SUV was launched in China. It is AWD with four electric motors and a combined output of 880 kilowatts, 1,197 horsepower. U8 can perform 360 degrees tank turn, wade, and float on water in emergencies. The off-road master will hit the market later and has some extra off-road add-ons, like a tougher-looking front bumper, that extends towards the bottom of the car to protect against collision in the wild. It also features a snorkel and detachable roof rack with a small ladder on the side. U8 Premium Edition costs 1,089,000 yuan, 150k USD, making U8 the most expensive China's mass-produced electric car. Master Off-Road Edition pre-sale price wasn't announced yet but is expected to be the same. Yang Wang U8 is a giant SUV with dimensions, L slash W slash H, 5319 slash 2051 thousand of a millimeter and a wheelbase of 3050 millimeters. It is 502 millimeters longer, 137 millimeters narrower, and 39 millimeters lower than the Mercedes-Benz G-Class. As for the wheelbase, it is 160 millimeters longer. The car sits on an E4 platform and is equipped with a disused P hydraulic body control system, which allows the vehicle to rise and lower up to 150 mm. Despite such enormous dimensions, it is only a five-seater, not offering a third-row option. The gross weight is 3,985 kg, and the curb weight is 3,460 kg, based on meat release data. U8 is an electric range extended vehicle, EREV, likely auto. It means it has an ICE that works as a power generator for the battery but isn't connected to the wheels. In this case, a 2.0 liters turbo powers a 49.05 kilowatt hours blade battery with LFP chemistry inside. It is supplemented with cell to chassis, CTC, technology, which means the battery is integrated into the chassis. The range is 180 kilometers under CLTC terms, and the comprehensive range with a full battery and 75 liter fuel tank is 1000 kilometers. ICE is mated with quad electric motors, each with a power of 220 kilowatts. Total power is 880 kilowatts with 1280 newton meters peak torque. Top speed is limited to 200 kilometers per hour, and 0 to 100 acceleration is 3.6 seconds. According to Car News China information from sources familiar with the matter, BYD is also considering the all-electric version next year. That would compete with Dongfeng's all-electric off-road beast Am Hero 917. U8 supports DC fast charging up to 110 kilowatts, making 30% to 80% possible in 18 minutes. Its 6 kilowatts vehicle to load (VTL) discharge capability can power electronic devices for up to 25 hours. The silicon heart of Yang Wang's SUV is the NVIDIA Drive Orin Soak, with a computational power of 508 tops. 38 sensors feed it with input, including 3 liters, 13 cameras, 12 ultrasonic radars, and 5 mm wave radars. It supports cell 2 Audis. BYD's Yang Wang U8 performed 360 degrees tank turn on a narrow bridge. Inside the car, you find lots of Napa leather and six massive screens, a 23.6 inches instrument panel for the driver, a 12.8 inches central control screen, and another 23.6 inch infotainment screen for the co-pilot. Two more screens are for rear passengers mounted to the back of the front seats, and the last LCD is on the console between the rear seats. There is also a 70 inches augmented reality head-up display and 22 speakers from Dynaudio. The U8 also features three smartphone wireless chargers and some not-so-common in-car tech, such as a thermographic camera and integrated satellite phone. Both versions of U8 have spare tires. Like every good off-roader, U8 can wade. The Premium Edition can wade in a maximum depth of 1,000 mm, while the Off-Road Master Edition can wade up to 1,400 mm thanks to the snorkel. 
When the waiting mode is activated, the vehicle will use its sensors to monitor the environment, water depth, wheel slip status, etc. The emergency floating mode is automatically activated when the car gets into depth over the limit. When activated, the combustion engine will immediately shut down. This use P will raise the suspension to the maximum level, windows will be closed automatically, AC will be switched to internal circulation, and the sunroof will open, providing an emergency exit. Moreover, the vehicle will display the water depth and attitude on the central control screen. UA can stay afloat for 30 minutes and move forward at 3 km per hour by accelerating and turning wheels. It can even perform tank turns while floating. BYD highlights that it is only for emergencies such as floods and not for fun crossing lakes and rivers. Interestingly, their marketing materials showcase U8 floating on the water exactly in those situations. After the emergency floating mode activation, the car needs to be brought to a service center for inspection. BYD claims U8 is IP68 level waterproof.